town down or well, down that sort of area it's the second biggest town never to have a team in the top flight of English football but at home park you can see 18 19,000 fans every week it's a club that's very well supported so much so that the number 13 in their squad list has been given uh, to the Green Army to the fans Lopez Caro and we heard him again earlier in the week saying he did lo lose his confidence a little bit but he's uh, starting to gain it then he said what doesn't kill you makes you stronger and uh, he said he's hoping to prove to Fabio Capello that he is good enough as is this man Carlos Diogo comes down the right hand side headed away in the center by Alger Free and Diogo lays it back to Guti Good ball to Juan Fran. Great play by Juan Fran down the right hand side. Puts it into the box. Just a little bit too much on it, but it was a great work by the Real Madrid number 30. Good work by the Brazilian. And he's got a lovely ball through to Cassano. Barry Hales. Down to David Norris. Barnes now overlaps down the right-hand side, puts the cross in. And Diego Lopez does well to claim. And Juan Fran looks to start a counter-attack. And the round number 30 plays it forward into Portillo. Good save, Luke McCormick. Post about 10 minutes ago. So half an hour gone here in the first pre-season friendly of the 2006-2007 season. It's Real Madrid nil, Plymouth Argyle nil. You're watching it live and exclusive here on Real Madrid TV. The ball's put into the box and it's a chance for Plymouth. In the end, Raul Bravo does it. And it'd be Diogo to take the throw in. Let's start off by confirming the Argyle on lineup. It's John Clapham in goal. Fascinating story about him, I'll tell you that in a moment. Tony Carvalho, Scott Laird, Mario Almeida and Paul Connolly make up the back four. It's then George Hitt on the left, Ruben Reid on the right, with Paul Watton and Nilian Nadis in the centre of midfield. And it's Sylvain Ebanks Bakke with Nick Chadwick up front. Look out for Bakke, he's the new signing from Manchester United. £200,000 he costs, that's about €300,000, probably a little bit more in fact. He's got a hat-trick on his debut only a few days ago. It's confirmed still, Real Madrid nil, Plymouth Argyle nil. Ten past seven here in Austria. And it's played down the right, taken by Ruben Reid. Lays it to Paul Connolly. It's good work by Connolly. Puts the ball into the box. Good tackle by Helguera. And it's Guti now on the ball. It's Lillian Nallis now on the ball. He takes it down the right to Paul Connolly. It's Watson. A long ball down the left. He's looking for he bags back, eh? And he finds Calpaldi. In Holloway, the Plymouth coach, be happy that it's 0-0, I'm sure, at the moment. As it's still a red. It's a good little flick on from Soldado on to Balboa. Balboa now walking it down the right-hand side. Puts the cross into the box, looking for Baptista! Into Soldado! And what a great save by John Clapham. And it's taken 21 minutes. But we have our first shot on goal in the second half. Great work by Balboa down the right. The ball comes in. It's four and Soldado. And now to Balboa! Oof. It's a great last ditch. Save there by Laird. And the ball comes in. It's Mejia. Back to Balboa. Not the best cross. 
Gives away a corner, which you could say was pretty unnecessary. Real Madrid's fifth of the game. And the ball comes in. Falls to Dillared. Puts the ball into the box. Batista, handball. And the referee points to the spot. I don't think you'll ever see a more blatant penalty. It's Lillian Nallis whose hand meets the ball. And I think Plymouth players will have a look at the replay of this and they will have no arguments and it'll be Julio Baptista who will step up and take the spot kick. I think uh, he just got a little bit nervous there and really didn't have to do that, but disappointment for Plymouth, but Julio Baptista should step up and put this one away. I believe it is Luke McCormick's actually stayed on for the second half. So he'll be trying to save this as Julio Baptista takes. And Julio Baptista puts it in the back of the net as Real Madrid take a 1-0 lead in this first pre-season friendly against Plymouth Argyle. Head of the way. It's Naris who brings it forward. Lays down the right-hand side to Reed. Reed with the ball into the box. It was a poor delivery, but then almost a poor clearance by Halguera. He gets the second bite of the cherry, and this time he clears it. It's a free kick that's taken quickly. In now to Hurado. Look at the speed of Balboa down the right. It's a lovely ball into Balboa. Still Javier Balboa. Plays it across. Oh! Roberto Soldado. You would have put your house on him putting that away. Maybe is Plymouth's Roberto Carlos. He's known for his bullets of free kicks. We're going to see one now. Oh, it was a good effort. It's well claimed by Diego Lopez. Plymouth's first shot on goal in this second half. So Soldado with the free kick. It's Garcia! Oh, off the uprights! headed away and it's a chance now for Soldado still Roberto Soldado great save John Clapham went to come and then went back and then he saved to deny Roberto Soldado who really could have had a hat trick and the referee blows the final whistle here it marks the end of the first match of Real Madrid's 2006-2007 pre-season tour in Austria. It's ended in a victory. A Julio Baptista penalty halfway through the second half has handed Real Madrid a 1-0 victory over Plymouth Argyle.